हेलो गाइस दिस इज संजय राठी वेलकम टू द सेशन कॉफी विद कॉन्सेप्ट नाउ इन दिस सेशन वी विल डिस्कस टू इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स दैट इज वन इज ड्रिफ्ट एंड अनदर वन इज डिफ्यूजन करंट रिमेंबर दीज टू टॉपिक्स आर इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर इलेक्ट्रिकल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन ब्रांच एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर ऑल कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स लाइक ई एस सी दैट इज इंजीनियरिंग सर्विसेज एग्जाम गेट एग्जाम बार इसरो डी आर डी ओ ओके नाउ गाइज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉच दिस दिस द लेवल ऑफ वॉटर इज सेम देर इज नो डिफरेंस इन द लेवल राइट टेल मी द वॉटर विल मूव फ्रॉम वन पॉइंट टू अदर विदाउट एनी एक्सटर्नल फोर्स इन दिस केस इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल नॉ सेकेंड केस हियर no doubt the level is same because of some disturbance or because of air there is some movement but when we are calculating the average velocity it is zero if you want to transport the water from one point to other then you have to apply external force like motor pump then watch this here it is a dam the water will flow from higher level to lower level but first of all we have to create a concentration gradient or a level difference so this side the water is very high and this side the water is very low or just almost zero but there is a one gate it will stop the flow of water once we will open the gate then water will start flowing without any external force without any external motor and this flow will be very very high it depends upon the concentration gradient that is called the slope of that part this is the case and that is the this phenomena is known as diffusion and that is the important concept of diode an important concept of bjt okay now guys drift and diffusion current the two important process for transporting the charge hence causing current are first one drift second one diffusion then what is drift current means under the influence of electric field that is the drift current is electronic current due to the motion of charge carrier under the influence of external electric field watch this diagram now it is a n type bar n type means the doping is nd that is donor type concentration of electron is very very high as compared to concentration of holes but there is no external field then motion of electrons and motion of hole is what random and that's why average drift velocity is zero but when we are applying the electric field external electric field in x direction then since the charge of electron is negative therefore the electron will move in opposite direction if electric field is in x direction then electron will move in negative x direction but remember the current will be in positive x direction then similarly for p type bar we are giving acceptor type doping the concentration of hole is very very high as compared to concentration of electron but when there is no external electric field the average velocity is zero then when we are applying the electric field in positive x direction it will exert force on holes in positive x direction that is in the direction of electric field because the charge of hole is positive now the hole will move from positive point of electric field to what negative means that is the in the direction of electric field okay 
remember but there is no concentration gradient the concentration is uniform throughout the bar okay this is the moment because of electric field and that's why we are saying that drift current is due to electric field now watch the level of water here there is no difference in the level and that's why there is no flow in the water now if you want to transport the water from one point to other point then you have to use external force just like in drift current we have to use extra or external electric field now watch this when we are putting a pump here and then after giving the electrical supply then we can transport the water means extra force is required when there is no difference in the level now that is the drift current if you want normally we are expressing the drift current in terms of current density that is j j is given by i by a where a is the cross sectional area and i is the current and you can watch that is the direction of the current and the current we and current enter here and it will leave the bar here and this is the area of the bar and electric field is in this direction if it is hole then it will move in the same direction if it is electron then it will move in the opposite direction what are the important formula drift current depends upon concentration of charged particle whether it is electron or hole that is n or p it also depends upon the applied electric field then that is the formula for the drift current density that is jn is given by i by a n q mu n into e here mu n is the mobility e is the applied electric field q is the charge that is 1.6 into 10 raised to power minus 19 coulomb now drift current due to holes is given by p q mu p into e here mu p is the mobility of holes e is the electric field and that is the q means again 1.6 into 10 to power minus 19 coulomb what is the total drift current then you have to add these two and you will get the formula for total drift current that is the current because of electron because of holes and then finally total drift current density is given by n q mu n into e plus p q mu p into now watch these two bottle in bottle number one the level of water is high and in bottle number two level of water is low now the water will flow from higher level to lower level that is the natural phenomena that is the diffusion from higher concentration to lower concentration i think now it is visible to you now levels are equal diffusion current means migration of charged particle from higher concentration to lower concentration so this is the definition the diffusion current can be defined as the flow of charge carriers within a semiconductor travels from a higher concentration region to a lower concentration region now first of all get the idea about n type bar then that is the diagram guys in this diagram watch the figure at one end the concentration of electron is very very high at the other end concentration is almost zero now without any electric field without any external force the electron will move from higher concentration to lower concentration and that is because of concentration gradient and that is called diffusion now there is a concentration gradient dn by dx when concentration decreases in x direction means gradient is negative so here the dn by dx is negative electron will move in positive x direction but current will be in opposite direction means in negative x direction 
second p type bar now in case of p type bar the concentration of hole is very high at one end and it is almost zero at the other end now there is a again negative concentration gradient because it is decreasing in positive x direction that is dp by dx is negative without any external field the hole will move from higher concentration to lower concentration and there will be the current in positive x direction because the charge of hole is positive right then what are the important formula for diffusion current first of all watch these two diagram so that you can compare it electron is moving in positive x direction hole is moving in positive x direction because of the concentration gradient but due to hole the current will be in positive x direction but due to electrons current will be in negative x direction in both the cases concentration gradient is negative that is dp by dx dn by dx both are negative now watch this formula then guys first of all diffusion current due to electrons when we are saying that this is the diffusion current due to electrons then current density jn is given by q dn dn by dx where dn is called diffusion coefficient dn by dx is called concentration gradient it is negative means we are going to get the complete answer negative negative answer means current is in negative x direction what's the formula for holes this is given by minus q dp by dx again the concentration gradient is negative but when we are putting the value the negative negative will become positive we are going to get positive numerical value means current is in positive x direction that is in the direction of holes now what is the total diffusion current that is drift uh, sorry that is because of holes and that is because of electron n diffusion jp diffusion as you know the formula q dn dn by dx minus q dp dp by dx there is one relation einstein relation with the help of einstein relation we can relate the diffusion coefficient and mobility with volt equivalent of temperature that is dp by mu p is equal to dn by mu n is equal to vt here vt is given by kt by q dn and dp are the diffusion coefficient for electron and hole respectively mu n is the mobility of electron and mu p is the mobility of hole and that is the important formula so this is all about drift and diffusion phenomena these two phenomena are very very important get the command over these two topics then if you enjoy the session like the session share the link of this session and subscribe our channel thank you very much and good luck for all coming exams